Can you, as a normal participant in the YAWL workflow case, manually pick the person who will execute the next work item? The answer is yes, but you need to be the boss. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and I do videos on business process automation. This video is part of a series on your tutorials. Today I'll show you how to delegate work items to members of a team. If you want to know how to create a team, check out the previous tutorial. In this video I will show you two things. First, prepare the workflow specification for allowing delegation and second, show a running case that uses delegation. In the description below is a link to the files you need with this example. Okay, here we are. Um, we will first look at the editor, what we have to do in the editor in order to allow for delegation. So here we have the task approve leave request and we select this and um, we go to the resourcing here. And we can see that this is offered to the approver role. And in addition, here's a filter that says that the org structure, the position here, has to be the approver boss. So you can see that we can add all these constraints in this little sub-window here. This is one thing. And the other thing that needs to be checked is that the task privilege of allowing work item delegation is checked here. So these are the preconditions that delegation works. And now we have already started a case for this uh, workflow here and we go to um, the admin work list and in the admin work list we will now offer this to Ron Roddenberry who is already logged in here at the bottom to make things easier. So and now this is here so we have this submit leave request now. And uh, we'll first fill in a name and a destination. And we complete this work item. Now we are at approve leave request. And if we refresh here, we have this offered to the boss of the approver team. So this is correct. And um, if we now accept this work item. Uh, now it's allocated and we go to these other options here on the right hand side. We can now delegate this to one of the team members and I press delegate and now I see Rosa Main and Ray Ree. So I will choose Rosa Main and if I go back up here to the admin work list I can now see that this work item is allocated to Rosa Main. Can you use this in practice? Let me know in the comments.